I spend a lot of time on this video, so I really hope you guys enjoy. If you do, please consider showing your support and following my socials, Instagram, and Twitter in the description. Thank you, and I hope you enjoy the video. Day two, unrated. Just a terrible dream that reminded me that I need to add some more honeycombing to the back of my base. If you're new here and you haven't seen part one, we settled down in our permanent base location. All right, I'm happy. I like it, I like it a lot. We got familiar with the area and we met a lot of our new neighbors. Nice to finally get you on board. We created an alliance with some of the new players on the server, Wiljum, Blueprint, and Hjun, and we even settled some conflict between Hjun and his nearby neighbors. Nice try, pussy. Thanks for the loot, bitch. Yeah, they're coming. Two coming. I almost found one. He's almost dead, he's almost dead. Four times. Dead, nice, one dead. dead, he's dead. Good shit. Or so we thought. Dude, I'm just so happy that X-Ray dude died. Yeah, we, that, was, that was clean. That was clean. What? Well, I'm dead. What? How did I die? And we finished it off by making some brand new enemies right before logging off for the night. They're gonna wanna know where I live. But regardless of what happened, we weren't raided, today was a new day, and this was just the beginning. All right, we'll put a gate right there, and we'll put a gate on that back side. And we'll call it good. Beautiful. There will be no blowing into the back of this space, so that is for sure. And if I high call this roof, there will be no blowing down into the space either. So here's a cool trick I learned while I was on the server. If I was ever running puzzle underneath airfield, then I was able to hear the tunnel system underneath the puzzle. That means I would hear anybody coming in on the train system. So I got in the habit of finishing up the puzzle and always checking the elevator shaft to see if anyone was coming up. Bro, man's had all that and no scrap, or am I tripping? That's 
so scary out here. What is going on? All right. I want to check this body one more time. Make sure I wasn't blind to so much fucking scrap. Meme Lord, again. Look at all these red cards. That's 400 scrap if I sell this. A lot of scrap. We want to make a run up there. I guess we can. We'll take this little bit, so we'll take the train. It was early in the morning, but there was already action outside my base, and I was not disappointed. I decided to get a lot of base stuff done first before the rest of the team got on. Holy shit, what the fuck is that castle? I heard you got a new place. I heard you got a new job. I heard you got a haircut. And it looks real nice. Alright, 400 scrap. I want to run HQM quarry today. Where is it? Here in the snow. Fuck. 20 HQM for one diesel. They're gatekeeping, man. Natural raid going on. Go make sure it's not Wiljims. Wiljims is the closest one to me, so. I'm out of ammo. The hell? Holy shit. Remember fish? They obviously live nearby. I just didn't know exactly where. Finally, Joe. These fools slowed me down from checking out the satchel raid, and if it was Wiljum's base, they would have already been in. But luckily, it wasn't. It does, it does, it does. Get that. Oh, that is amazing. Now I'm gonna do you all a favor and save you some time, a lot of time, on the process of building this shooting floor tower. For some reason, the stability was off on one side of the tower and it made me very, very angry and wasted a shitload of my second day. But finally, bottom floor. Oh my god, it only took me two fucking hours to set this shit up. Oh my god. When I finally finished, the base was absolutely beautiful. It was like a mini sanctuary design for a solo player.
A lot more sun up here. And it was right then, after all that stressful hard work, that the Rust Gods sent their certified coziest base builder to give a stamp of approval. Billy J. God damn! Oi! Oh, shit! Oi, bro! Oi. What the fuck is this? I got a compound. My God, I thought I was the first. Nope, clearly not. <laughs> this is cool, man. But you got the shooting floor below the front door. Oh, that's sick. Nah, you've got a lift. What the fuck? <laughs> I don't think I've ever seen one of these actually in a base before. Yes, sir. Doors to match. <laughs> oh, no. This is this is definitely the best base out of everyone. And with that statement, I could finally die happy now. As a matter of fact, I wrapped up with everything base building related and decided I would now dedicate my next few hours to getting some action. People taken. Someone's taken tunnels. My station had no trains, so I would make my journey on foot towards military tunnels. Oh, they're killing the scientists in the fucking tons.
Fuck me. No fucking way, MJ. I have nothing to say. Alrighty, buddy. Got my revenge on MJ, and half my shit back, but his buddy was nowhere to be found. I never saw him again after that. He got away with the armored door, which was an L, but at least we made it back home with the scrap and the metal face mask. Losing that armored door convinced me to bite the bullet and tear up to one myself with the scrap that I had in my base. I took a break for a few hours, and when I logged back in, the rest of the team was online, talking in Discord as solos. It's more than one. I'm like, fuck it, I'm going for this. <laughs> and then I die and throw. I need to what stop the this. freaking heck are you guys doing? <laughs> you guys are communicating over Discord. There's no Discord in Rust. What are you doing? All right. No, right. All right. Bye -bye. Well, I guess <laughs> Rust, <laughs> oh, man. Rust comes in, ruins our fun. We see. Okay. I'll see you later, guys. <laughs> see you later, guys. What the fuck? I was just kidding. He's building something. Fucking great. Oi! Hello, hello. Yes, how's it going? Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you, mate. Hello, hello. Oh, I just wanted to check that the number. Oh, I just wanted to check that the number worked. Fuck me, that's loud in my ear, though. Mate, Walking turn down the voice volume! My phone. <laughs> After that, I called him back. I wanted him to stop by my base because I had a trade offer for him. I never realized how close to airfield you were. I didn't even know Dude. you could build this close. Bro, this like wall <laughs> is touching the this the it you can't like place right there. You can't place anything closer than this. <laughs> but it's I up on the rock. Say, I thought airfield had quite a big uh quite a big range. Um, I wanted to know if you wanted to make a trade. Do you have armored door? I do not have armored door, no. Do you want one fully crafted single armored door in return for a fully crafted auto turret? That sounds like a wonderful deal. I learned and crafted a few auto turrets and then got word that Wiljam and Blueprint were in a bit of a pinch at water treatment. I headed over to help out.
You're still fighting? I just, uh, uh, just wait, 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 I think he's here. There's someone inside I just heard. Like behind the wall. On your left. Hit him once, twice. Behind me, there's a fucking. Killed one. Another one with a nail gun above him. He's got an MP5. Nice. We noticed a Shinna crate had landed over at Train Yard, and since we were all together, we decided we'd go over and look for a fight. That's good. Thank you. But before we could get there, the grubs in the area would prove to be more profitable than the Shinna crate itself. Dude, is this guy, like, stupid? Damn, look at that invent, brother. What the fuck? Um, I got a <laughs> depot. Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> Behind you, there's a guy. Hold him. Oh, this guy had a row of wood on him, too. I do see two DB guys chasing us from west, by the way, Frost. I'm dead! Holy oh, shit, dead. dude! You're dead to like, DBs. right as you say that, yeah. DB right on my, where, I, where I died. We're, we're W King. He's right here, he's right here. He's dead, he's dead. Thank you, Jesus, man. That's crazy. Wait, this guy's molly raiding, right? What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> He's dead. Yoka behind me, holy f This server's popping off now. The action was proving to be abundant in Blueprint and Wildrum's area, so I decided to stick around and continue using Blueprint's base as my personal storage. This guy right here. About to finish the Wait, you finished the raid? What the fuck? That guy was so quick with it. 600 what scrap! I got a depot again! <laughs> Why was this face? Hold up, I know where Gaylor lives. It's this one right here. We're hitting this, we're hitting this. Wait, stop! Double headshot, he's dead. Nice. Oh my god. Oh. Okay, I broke it. PC. Oh my god, there's another shoddy trap, but it's empty. Cleared. Putting on door. Pretty decent. Yeah, decent TC shit. Absolutely of everything. This is all you blue. Um, I'm gonna leave you with the rest. Okay. Enjoy. Thanks, man. Beastman, Zaddy, and the Fisherman. Looks like my neighbors were online. Holy fuck, I just wiped five guys.
the perfect place to die. The only opening in my forest that I could see from my roof. The locker kit came in handy for once. Now, it's about time we start to tie more strings between the people living in my area. Dude, they live right here, man. I could f I need to follow them home. I'm stuck in a tree. I'm stuck in a tree. Three of them. <sighs> this is probably TiVo. It seemed like TiVo's group was just fighting my neighbor Zaddy, and with both of them online, this area would be hot. I would need to lay low. Yep. Both teams were around, and I was extremely paranoid as to who was going to be the first to jump me outside my base again. So it's branching out 31. Exactly. Then we put one into there. Boom. Now this goes to the fucking lights, baby. Okay, that's perfect. Now let's get some extra metal frags and craft a shitload of ceiling lights. Evo outside my base being a fucking rat. Frost went AFK for the next few hours and went to the gym. He was gone for three in-game rust days to be exact. Hmm. I was just about to get off and now they're gonna... Hit me with a fucking rocket raid? Nope, there's still guys there.
So TiVo, who I saw fighting my neighbors on the hill, who I had on my possible hit list, I thought lived in this base. Well, as a matter of fact, I know they lived in that base. I saw them run in through the front door. But when I went back to check the raid, they drove in from an opposite direction. So where were they putting the loot? Was this not even their main base? Did they have a bigger one? Since Aishun was still on, I asked him if he wanted to join me on the hunt for TiVo and his group, find out where they were storing their loot. Oh shit, there's a fat stone compound right over here. Dude, see? Yeah, I think this is their main. I think this is their main here. Is it a big base? I think maybe they just stashed in that one for a while and... Camper? Is there a camper there? I'm looking for one. I don't see one yet. What one's coming out the door right now? Oh, I a few are. Uh, maybe let them pass. He's out right now. He's full kit. He's building just a external TC. He's loading up external TC, two full kits. Yeah, this is them, it looks like. We had high suspicion that this was TiVo's base, but we had to make sure. They must have moved overnight. The question was whether we tried to fight them at their base or not. We waited until nightfall to see if they would make any silly mistakes. Oh, I'm getting silenced. I'm dead, I'm dead. What? He has a MVGs or something. Really? And there's an LR guy named Fish. This was them, standing a lot stronger than I expected. I was not going to lose my AK kit fighting them at their home. I would save this fight for another day. Aitchun got offline after that, and I would as well shortly. That was the end of day two for me. Oh, unrated, baby. Let's go. Welcome to day three. Not a single one of my teammates were raided overnight. We were all safe. I would finish what I started yesterday and finally hook up all the lights in my base. Oh my god. That was the last one and it has one power left. Holy shit. I'm literally using every single fucking possible bit of electricity from that battery and windmill. That windmill is huge, bro. And it all goes off. <laughs> I'm fucking done! The only thing I'm looking for now is I want to set up like three more solar panels into another medium battery and I have like two more auto turrets. A fourth? You're fucking kidding. Ah! 
I honestly don't even know if the last guy was with the team of three. He looted one inventory's worth of loot, and he ran. Nobody else showed up after that. The satchel that I got inside that box would signify the start of what today would be focused around. Raiding. In all aspects. Starting with the raid defense kits that I would build around my base. I also had some bases around me that if I took control over, I can make them counter raid bases. Ah, oh, fuck. Come on. Oh shit, there was a box in here and another satchel. Hello sir, is this a wood door? Yes, it is. Oh, shit! Worth. God damn, Molly rating is gonna be worth, dude. Funny thing is, while I ran back to my cozy sanctuary to craft measly little mollies and satchels, Blueprint logged on in his stone-cold prison and started crafting rockets. He messaged in Discord that he only needed one thing, a rocket launcher. And I don't know if you remember, but I found one in my first milk crate when I logged on the server at the very, very start of White. Blueprint Wiljam and I went on a long journey to go look for it. Little did we know, the peaceful lands that we once crossed when we were naked starting out on the server had now become hell. So I hopped. I have a hammer. Ah, this close to gas, there's no way it's still there. Over this. Then I ran to the ledge here. There was a rock here, a tree here, and a bush here. It should be like in this stump. Oh, God. Uh oh, we're gonna get. Twice, one, one HP. I can't find it! I need to chop this tree. I think this thing spawned on it. Look, dude, dude, you just had to hit him one, one time. I was fucking in a, behind a bush, metting. I hit him once with M5. Oh, on me, on me, on me. I'm down, I'm down, I'm behind this stump. Dude, please! Oh, Emo, what the fuck? I'm one. Getting shot by someone else, and I'm down from 3,450 meters. Yeah, he's in a zip line, bro. There's no way. It was official. Tier 1 zone was hell. If I wanted to get my rocket launcher, I would have to blend in. Okay, I have a screenshot on my left monitor of where it is, and I'm comparing it to my game right now. And this is how... Bro, it's so much, so much shit going on oh. here. Oh my 
my god, I got it. The stash. It's here, yeah. Holy shit. How's it going, man? Can you pick me up? I just... I'm coming, boys. I got it. I'm running home. I'm running for my life right now. Hey! Hey! Here you are, sir. We got the launcher home. Let's go. Oh, shit. You've been following Frost's point of view for some time now. This is the very moment things start to get interesting for him. So pay attention. <gasps> guys, guys, crate at airfield. You guys want to come? Oh, yeah. Oh, shit. Okay. Yeah, I'm done. Oh, crate shit. at airfield. That's the first time that ever happened. Yeah, I've never seen one of those. Okay. It's already activated. Interesting. Interesting. Not too far. It feels like such a long trek because of that mountain. Okay, I'm in tower. I don't know why it wasn't taken. The door was closed. There's nobody on the roof either. Okay, there's a hazy guy in the, the center tower. I see him. 13 minutes exactly on the crate. And there's a truck pulling up, armored truck. This truck driving by wasn't actually interested in the crate. He was going back to his base. And the person driving it? I'm inside the hangar right now. Oh, well, one's on the roof as well. He already sees me. What the fuck? Like, main roof. That's really annoying. Someone's below me. I wanted to befriend this guy below me so he didn't sneak in and shoot me in the back of the head. Right. I... I'm holding the tower, you hold the bottom, okay? For us? Aw, oh, fuck, dude. Well, my cover was now blown, and I didn't really know what to do, so I didn't say anything else for the remainder of the crate. Double headshot one, he's lit. Headshot hit hit, one's down in there. Alright, I'm on my way. I will have a line on crate when they push for that. So. They're tagging the fuck out of the guys below me. Oh, I'm wounded. Want me to clear them real quick? You could kill them if you want. I mean, they're just friendly, they're helping me, but you could get rid of them. It'll make it easier and quieter. He already died. Hit him three times. Hit them three more times, bro. They gotta be so low on meds. Yeah, bro. they can't have more meds. I'm gonna go over the headshot on the roadside, kid. This guy. I'm dead. I'm dead. Oh. One dead. Nice. Three times on him. He's one HP. I'm going up. Killed him. Nice. nice. I'm outside. I'm outside. Oh my god! This crate was the best one we got. What is it? Is it? AKLR. Oh. We divvied up the loot from the fight and the crate, and we all headed our separate ways. So this is Fisherman. Oh, you're Sean. Teamed with Beastman and Zaddy, living right up the hill from my base. Hey, Sean. I live right here. Fisherman, are you with, a uh, TiVo? No, if you want to come out naked, I can show you my base. Yeah. So you're the guy who lives right up the hill. You know the guys that I'm talking about? The T-E-E-B-O yeah, yeah, yeah. guys or whatever? I know, uh... 
like fish, like that group. Yeah, fish, fish. You're are are you with fish? You're with fish, right? I just got wounded. No, no, I'm not. That four man in the woods. No, I'm just a three man up on the hill right there. Like yeah, that I base fought you right guys there. We um, fought quite a bit. My vending machine. Yeah. Yeah, you killed me with AK quite a bit. <laughs> yeah, sorry about that. I mean, it's just probably going to continue, oh, but good. like we could at least be on like kind of like a give back alliance in case you wanted something that we kill each other for. But honestly, like I'm probably still going to keep fighting the same because uh, I'm just soloing. So. Oh, you're good. Yeah, yeah, no, you're, no worries. Um, yeah, you. that TEVO so. is the four man that lives right down the hill from you, and they moved. They live in a fat fucking chonker base in Y15 right now, so. Y15, alright. Yeah. Alright, man, I'm gonna go. I got I got stuff I gotta do, but I'll talk to you guys later, alright? See ya. It's always a little unsettling standing outside fully geared talking to complete strangers who you've killed in the past trying to now be friendly. I wanted to keep my distance, but there was a potential alliance forming here. Yo. Yo. I, I, um, you guys were fighting those guys that were grinding and stuff from airfield? They came up here? Yeah. What happened with them? Uh, we killed one, and we're just trying to build, but we killed one, and they ran off. Yeah, the other two ran down the hill with hazmats. I killed them. They were, they were headed down towards my base. <laughs> Yeah. I just wanted to yeah, make sure you guys there. didn't die to him. Kill people on the hill. Yeah, yeah. All right, man. I'll see you guys later. I'm headed west, so I'll be out of here. It was small talk, but it was progress. I was starting to crave an alliance with this group simply because I didn't want to be bothered while focusing on my other tasks in my area. All weird. <laughs> okay, so let's get back to business. I said today was a day of raiding, and I didn't just mean Molly and Satchel raids. And now that Blueprint had a rocket launcher, things would go a lot quicker. Got a new 2x2 two two that just popped up right in front of your base. Is it wood or is it stone now? It's a stone two by two, one sh one sheet metal door decor. They were just putting down the second one sheet metal doing door decor. Yeah, it might have some charcoal. I think it's worth for one rocket. This was the moment we started to become the big bad assholes of the server, raiding all the shitters to get their charcoal to raid the big dogs. Take these grenades. There's another door. Oh, look at his invent. Bro. I was in no it. No way. Hopefully you got some charcoal in this bitch. Mmm, no charcoal. Not much luck on the first base, but we were quick to choose a second. Blue spotted four geared players running from water treatment to this base. We knew it would be hot, and we would have to be quick. 
I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna go for it. They're trying to expand now. I can I can beam one now. You can initiate or do whatever you I'm need. Gonna, I'm on the left now. There's a naked. I'm gonna kill him. I'm gonna kill him. I'm gonna kill him. Okay, go for it. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. Red. He shot can, at me. Wait, you're dead. Yeah, you I have to pick you. me up. Okay. I'm heading. Yep. Bought your guns on the roof. I killed that one. Yeah. Oh! Yeah, blue. You've got. Yeah, yeah. I gotta get these guns. I gotta get these guns. Wait, you've got the rockets. Let us get in. Let us get in. I got it. I got it. I got it. I'm, I'm gonna Molotov this. Back up. Back okay. up. I'm four rocketing. Back up. Yeah. yeah. I got stuff to seal too. I'm dead. I'm Can you get that armor in there? I dropped okay. it. I dropped it. I'm good. I'm good. I think he's dead. I think he's dead. Can you get those bodies in there? I got hella stone if you need it. I got it all. Just watch bags in here. Watch bags. There's multiple guys coming from the compound. One's dead. Oh shit, these guys were absolutely fucking juiced. Nice charcoal, huge. Yeah, I saw that. Okay, now, wait, that's that's eight rockets worth, right? Oh, I'm depoting all the stone in there if you need it. There's a bunch in there. I just need to go outside and seal the front. Oh, oh my god. Oh! oh fuck, flash? I'm dead. One close, one far. I'm getting a back out of here real quick. One's on my body. Uh, no one's on your body yet. They can't get his AK yet, but there are like three of them. Yeah, I'm dead right below to the left. What the? Oh, I got stuck on got something, man. What? I'm dead. I don't know if like one of the doors got well, shut. Well, they can or... get in. Like, so they can get in because I haven't sealed the, the front yet. They're coming in. What you gotta do? I'm really close to Star Kid right now. Me too. Kill the full metal. I'm dead. Nice, nice, nice. I'm dead. I got. I got to respawn. Naked one. Go down there. Four I'm times. Dead. One. Dead. Three okay. of them popped out. And I'm getting attacked by a pig. Oh, you fucking joke. Full kill, kill, full kill, star. Full kill, star. Should be able to kill one in a second. One's dead. Okay, I'm coming out. Oh my god, I'm out of ammo. Where are you? Where are you? Outside. He's dead, he's dead. One's behind you, one's behind you. Yeah, yeah, I hear him, hear him. He's dead? Can I peek that airlock? Uh, you can try. He's dead, dead, dead. Nice. It's clear in here. They had a okay, door? Look at, look at radius, is fucking me. I'm securing him, they can't come in now. Big, big, big. Good job, good job. I had to hop in. I'm in like a secure airlock. Yeah, um, I fucked up. Got caught in the ladder and I'm dead to a Tommy. This one? This one? And the front door's open, by the way. Help me out, help me out. Oh, they're satcheling? Satchel. They're satcheling? I'm opening this door. Yeah, yeah. Okay. I'm opening this one. Dead, one dead. I closed the other door. Nice. We're, we're okay, we're okay. Yeah. Oh, I'm I'm insane, dude. I just quick Fortnite. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, are we good? No, no, no. There are like three outside still. All right, I'm about to be able to spray a couple. Yeah, dude. If you can spray a couple, I'll go to the roof. I'll go to the roof. Yeah, I'll go I'm, gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna open. I'm gonna open. I'm gonna open it, blue. Yeah, yeah, yeah. One coming, 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 coming. One dead. Two dead. Let's go. Let's go. I down too. Two dead Four here. guys up, up the hill. Headshot. Hit him once again. Uh, hit him once. Hit him again. Might be, he's probably dead. Probably dead. Hold it on. came out AK. Hit him once. He's dead. He's dead. AK dead. Oh yeah. yeah. Let's loot that shit. Alright, I'll come with you. Nice. Huge. We're not getting raided now. W. This is gonna save us, guys. It, it might do. Okay, here I go. Good luck, man. I love the fact that there's no key lock on it, too. <laughs> Dude, like, this ladder is just... I'm grabbing what it. What is I'm that? It. 
I'm DB'd. What the fuck? From where? Hey, he's he's making on the left. Uh oh. Oh my. Come out. Come out. AK. Hold up. I'm dead. I'm dead. Right. Nice. AK is dead. AK is dead. I'm not going top. Hey, where's my huh? teammate? Look up, look up. Look up. He's up? Yes. Yes. He's still there. Yeah. Oh, fuck. Yep. All right, let's go. Oh, fuck out of this hell hole, man. Was it horrible experience? It was pretty AIDS. I know that. I, I I always know that like two by two raids like that just to just go south so easily. Yeah. We all went home after that with enough charcoal, pipes, and guns to fund an even bigger raid. And the cool thing is, we didn't even need to search for a new target. They showed up at our front door. Well, Asians. What the fuck? Someone's throwing. Someone's flaming my walls, bro. Bro, what? you're about to get raided, bro. Yeah, like dead ass. There's a little there's literally a drone on me. On my base, like what the fuck? Dude, you are actually getting raided. It's over for you. Maybe just stick silent. No, I'm staying silent. I hate the raid. Most of you have already seen this next chapter on Wiljum, Hjun, and Blueprint's channel. And that's exactly why it's gonna kick off the next episode, with our final group adventure, before I go down a very, very deep rabbit hole. I've been deep down stuck in the gutter I've been off the grid today I've been lost just trying to forget her But I wake up and nothing's changed I've been gone down lost in the letters Trying to get back into play I've been losing ground and lost and found Cause I let it Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you all enjoyed the video. This was supposed to be two parts, but I decided to spend a few more days merging together day two and three for your viewing pleasure. I will see you all in the next video. I thought it wasn't worth it. Yeah, I thought it was too late. I was so burned out trying to ease my mind like there was nothing left to save.